present tense for future events. Why does it sound perfectly natural to say our flight leaves tomorrow at 6 p.m., but weird to say it rains tomorrow at 6 p.m.? What kind of scenario, if any, could make the rain sentence sound natural? The reason it is natural is because the fact that the flight is leaving tomorrow at 6 p.m. is absolutely known for sure, whereas you are only predicting that it might rain. You can't be entirely sure that it is going to rain, so, will, is used to note that you are predicting it. Even, it will rain tomorrow at 6 p.m., sounds wrong, for the same reason ham and bacon states, it's not a known thing. In the former example, though, you're technically describing a schedule, something that exists in the present, so the present tense can be appropriately used there. In continuation with the shorty prediction advocated in the other responses, you might also argue that we never know with a 100% confidence that the flight actually leaves at 6 p.m. tomorrow. The technically correct usage would be, and because the flight schedule is present. The flight is scheduled to leave at 6 p.m. tomorrow. As per the schedule, the flight leaves at 6 p.m. tomorrow. But for all purposes of common usage, the sentence you quoted in the question suffices for audience communication. Regarding your query for the rain situation, the only situation where it would sound appropriate, was it coming from a soothsayer, an oracle, or a psychic predicting tomorrow's weather? I guess it is within their business obligations to use such sentences to sound mighty sure and give themselves an aura of invincibility against nature's vagaries. If you want to support the channel, please consider liking and subscribing.